Hello guys, the pieces here. Today we're doing the top six best green shiny Pokemon. You know shiny green Pokemon have a bad reputation. So I decide, hey, let's just do a uh, top six. Anyways, uh, let's just start with the countdown, I guess. Number six goes to Trampish. You see, Trampish is a decent Pokemon. I mean, it is good and all. It's just, you know, its evolutions don't really make any sense. Like, their evolutions is like Dragon, but Trampish is just... Um, I'm sorry, I kind of forgot its types. I think it was... It was like a round rock. Mm. What makes this Pokemon look good is that it's green, but like it's not over the top green. As you see, there's it's more like a bluish green mostly, and then it's like bottom part is like just like a light green, but not too like not radioactive. So I like it because of how they don't put it over the top like other people. Number 5 is Noivern. And the thing that makes it fine is that, well, it's like they don't just add just green. They add in like purple, they add red and black. So, it doesn't make it that bad, you know? It could have been worse, like they could just make everything green and it just wouldn't stand out. Or like, since it's like has a lot of detail in it, it's not gonna make the green more like, eh. But And Noivern is a pretty good Pokemon, you know? Well, it's like a great, one of those great dragon types that usually all dragon types are good. Um, yeah, go to number four. The reason why I like Mega Beedro is because it looks like it was meant to be in the military or the army and stuff like that. And you know how they're green? Well, Beedro is green too, and its blue eyes actually make it stand out. Just not here. It's I like it because it's like a dark green, it's like a dark red, you know, a lot of dark stuff. Well, it has some white in it, but if you look at it, you it looks it reminds me like of it as a plane. And it's like it's like it's like wearing a suit of armor of planes. That's why it's a grass type starter, you know? Well, grass fighting time. And so, it like, it's also the part of the Beedro army thing, you know. It like stands out because you see people who like would fight and all that stuff, and they would always wear these this green stuff. Green suits. And, um, yeah. And you know who else looks good on green and red? I'm gay! Crustle here is not bad. It's a fine, it's a great, good looking Pokemon. Because it's shiny form. Well, yeah, Crustle and Tire is a good Pokemon. You get that in the desert. And so, you look at this thing, and it's just a bug. It's like a crab, you know? But then, when you look at its shiny form, it looks like a bug you cannot mess with, because it looks like radioactive. Yes, some shinies do look radioactive too, but this makes kind of more sense, you know? You see, the bug itself is radioactive, but I feel like the rock stands out, because the rock green is like a bright green that's like radioactive green too. 
and you're like, when she, and if you put a whiff bug, and it's like, yeah, if you put a black in it and all that stuff, gray, it makes it pretty awesome. Like, so there's weapons. Could be a use of weapons, you know? You too deserves an honorable mention because he, well, he, she. It's just, it's a fine shiny. It's okay to me. It's just that if it had any other colors, like, like, if it changed the white to black or, like, the green to, like, Like any other color. I mean, green would stand out, but if they changed the white part, it would actually kind of be cool, you know? So, and Mewtwo is like. If it's like, you know, on like radioactive, like again, like, if it's like, makes sense for like radioactive Pokemon, like Mewtwo became like radioactive all of a sudden, and that would be like cool, okay? Yeah. Okay, up to one, n number one. The UI. The CGI is the number one to me. And if you guys don't believe me that it's green, I, I checked, it's pine green. Just so you know, the hood and stuff. And it looks beautiful. Like, for some odd reason, Pokemon Sun and Moon made, like, made two of the shinies, two of the starter shinies good, like Incineroar and the Sigiwara, but not permanent. I don't really like I don't understand why people like But yeah, my favorite is Incineroar. But I like the Sigiwara too. If you like have it as a pet or something like that, or like you know for the holidays you might want the Sigiwara to be and it's just good. It really is good. It looks like it looks like something that like can hide. It could like blend in with stuff and it will look cool. Anyways, that is it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you all next time.